On July 7, 2023, the U.S. State Department approved a possible foreign military sale, FMS, to the government of France. The approved sale includes the procurement of 1,515 AGM-114R2 Hellfire missiles, accompanied by technical assistance, non-standard books, publications, integration support, and other logistical and program-related elements. The estimated cost of the entire package is $203 million. This marks the third occasion on which France has purchased Hellfire missiles. In 2015, the first sale included 200 AGM-114K-1A Hellfire missiles, along with conversion kits, blast fragmentation sleeves, installation kits, containers, and transportation. The munition and explosive MDE, costs were estimated to be $25 million while the total expected expense reached $30 million. In 2016, the second sale included 112 AGM-114K-1A Hellfire missiles, 102 AGM-114N-1A Hellfire missiles, and 50 ATM-114Q-1A Hellfire training missiles. Additionally, non-munition and explosive MDE, items requested comprised four Hellfire missile mock-up sectional models. For Hellfire 2 AGM-114N Warhead Mock UPS, 30 Hellfire M36E4 training missiles, and 60 Hellfire M60 dummy missiles. The total implemented value of this second sale reached $42 million, including all associated equipment, comprehensive training, and support services. The present sale, which is the largest of its kind for Hellfire missiles, was planned in accordance with the 2023 budget law to fulfill the needs of the French Air and Space Army GAE. General Stephen Mill, the Chief of Staff, mentioned this during a parliamentary hearing, stating that the objective is to replenish ammunition stocks. Additionally, it can be regarded as a component of worldwide initiatives to reinforce military capabilities. France currently utilizes Hellfire missiles for the Tigre helicopters of the Army Light Aviation ALAT, and the medium altitude long endurance male MQ-9 Reaper Block 5 drones of the AAE. However, France aims to use its own Akron LP missile or high frame missile MHT from MBDA in the future as part of developing the Tiger Attack Helicopters MK3 standard. The AGM-114 Hellfire 2 is an air-to-ground missile designed for anti-armor missions. It uses laser guidance for precision strikes and is widely employed in attack helicopter operations. The AGM-114R Romeo Hellfire 2, introduced in 2015, features a versatile K-charge warhead, improved trajectories, and a semi-active laser homing guidance system. It maintains compatibility with existing Hellfire 2 platforms. Weighing about 45 kilograms, measuring 163 centimeters in length and 17.8 centimeters in diameter, it has a range of 11 kilometers. The multi-purpose warhead offers selectable detonation modes for different targets, generating a high-speed, small-diameter jet or a slower, larger penetrator. It produces multiple adaptable fragments, and optional composite liners optimize performance. The Hellfire 2 missile provides aimpoint control and supports lock-on before launch or lock-on after launch modes. It can be deployed from helicopters like the AH-64, AH-1Z, or MH-60, as well as aircraft and unmanned aerial vehicles such as the Eurocopter Tiger, Augusta, Predator, and Reaper. There is ongoing consideration for a potential successor to the Hellfire missile, as well as the AGM-65 Maverick air-to-ground missile, called the Joint Air-to-Ground Missile JAGM. Due to budget constraints, the development of JAGM has been divided into increments. The first increment primarily focuses on enhancing the Hellfire R by incorporating a millimeter wave radar, which would enable it to have a dual-mode seeker capable of tracking moving targets even in adverse weather conditions.